Hey crafty friends, this is Jenny from crafttestummies.com and today I want to go with, over with you how to cut shrink plastic film using your Cricut. Now I'm using a Cricut Maker but this is the same process that you'll need for any Cricut machine using Design Space. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and get your project up and matted and ready to go and if you need any help with how to like convert your cut files or to download things you know I have a video on that take a look um, but what you're gonna do is when you go to make you're going to find where it says all materials and then plastic and I'm actually using the acetate setting which is the very first one under plastic select acetate and then done now what's gonna happen is it's gonna take you to the next screen and it says default pressure which is kind of medium click more give it a little bit more pressure trust me that helps then go ahead go to your machine and cut it out so here's my Cricut maker getting it ready to do its first little cut once it's all done here's the thing don't unload it now it's gonna flash the little unload button don't do it instead hit the cut button again and now what's going to happen is it's actually going to cut back over your exact same lines. If you unload the mat, it cannot do this. So don't unload the mat. Hit the cut button again. And this time you'll get a nice clean cut. Okay, so once you get it out, you're going to peel it back. And if it doesn't go all the way, you can kind of like just hold it down and peel back the extra material. See how this one didn't go exactly, but if I just kind of push it down with my finger, it will go all the way. I just wanted to make mention that this is metallic shrink film from Graphics and it's gold, but they also have a silver and it shrinks down to about 30% of its original size. So here it is on the charm with the latitude and longitude for our AFS daughter. And I just think it makes a nice overall project. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you found it helpful. Please like, subscribe, and as always, have a crafty day.